FM 100 ICRT. I was going to uh, have uh, some special guests on the line, or they're here in the studio, actually. Uh, originally, I, I this, this morning, for some reason, I was thinking a uh, phone call. I, I told you I'd have them on the phone. They're in the studio live, so I'm very excited. Uh, we were talking earlier about PTS World Taiwan. It's a, a, a fairly new YouTube channel. And it's uh, it it basically is is bringing Taiwan to the world through uh, through all kinds of shows that PTS here in Taiwan, Gong Gong Dian Shi, has had and shown. So uh, we're talking about that today with uh, Supervisor Yang Li, and he's from the Department of New Media, and their social media editor Whitney Hong. So uh, good morning, you two. Hi, good morning. And good morning. Very glad to be here. Good morning. Now, uh, I, I, I've been told that uh, Whitney is going to be talking about most of the stuff, but of course I wanted to uh, uh, say hi to Young and welcome you to ICRT. Uh, so, okay, For just uh, first things first, PTS World Taiwan. Um, uh, I, for those of our listeners who may not know, I think most of you know PTS, right? Gong Gong Dian Shi, it's very famous in Taiwan, been around for many, many years uh, but for just in case, those of our listeners who may not know, including uh, any expats here who uh, may not have seen it, um, I, I can't think of many people who have not seen PTS. It, yeah. It's, yeah, it's a huge thing <laughs> it's in Taiwan. Huge. Yeah, it's been 20 years. Uh, yeah, uh, so, well, uh, what you've been doing on this platform, it, it's been over 20 years, right? So uh, let's talk about the Taiwan Public Service, Taiwan, or Public Television Service Foundation. Uh, what what's public service media? What is PTS? Yeah, uh, yeah, very happy to share a bit about this. Um, so, public service media, of course, by its name, it's a media entity that serves the public. Mm-hmm. So it is commercial free. That's the biggest difference. Uh, some well known public media service you may have heard of around the world, like BBC in the UK, yeah, like NHK in Japan, mm-hmm. right? And so in Taiwan, it's PTS. So it's fully named the Public Television Service. Yeah. So P- PTS belongs to the public and works to provide some independent and impartial programs with a mission to make Taiwan a better place. And so it's operated by the non-profit Taiwan uh, Public Television Service Foundation. So that's the essence of it. And I always like that when you say, you know, it's uh, that that kind of helps keep out all of the, well, any, any of the biases, uh, you know, from uh, public televisions or from uh, other TV stations that may be owned by certain companies or whatever. When you talk about a publicly owned uh, foundation like this, um, it basically the goal is just to give good programming. Yeah, like we cover everything that usually sometimes commercial TV cannot do or they wouldn't be uh, intended to uh, to broadcast because it wouldn't make money. Exactly. Right. Exactly. Uh, so, okay, now we know that PTS launched its first English online streaming platform, PTS World Taiwan, last October. Uh, can you let our audience know a little bit about what they could watch on the platform? Yeah, super happy to talk about our brand new uh, bilingual streaming platform on YouTube, PTS World Taiwan. So you can watch, uh, So as you may know or seen already, PTS has uh, produced some of the most popular TV series in Taiwan, such as Sikalu Formosa, 1867, uh, or the coming through Tijidanyur that set scene behind Taiwan's economic miracle in the 1970s. Uh, so we are making these shows, these popular TV series, available to English-speaking audiences. Yeah. Yeah, and not only to foreigners living in Taiwan, but also around the globe. So, like, YouTube is a global platform. So, and we have it with both English and Chinese subtitles which are, like, very friendly for those language learners. Yeah. And, and very important as well. Uh, you know, one of the... Since the the advent of uh, being, able, being able to watch things on the Internet, um, honestly, uh, people, they, they like to check out things from all around the world. Yeah, um, I, I like to check out, uh, you know, series from the UK that I might never have never heard of here. Um, I also look for 
ones from languages that I don't know. Um, you know, like uh, what do they what do they show on TV in Russia? What do they show on TV in uh, Brazil? Yeah, absolutely. And, and you and can find that on YouTube. And so I'm really excited that YouTube now they can find shows that are from Taiwan. Yeah, exactly. And we believe that stories are the best way to like really learn about the people, the culture, and the history. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So. We are very excited to do this now. Like it should have been done like much earlier, I believe. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And well, and one thing that PTS is known for, has been known for over the years, is trying to put out programming that is quality programming. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, so tell tell us some of the some of the th- things that people can find on the platform. What kind of shows can they find? Series, documentaries. Uh, what kinds of things are available? So apart from the popular TV series we mentioned earlier, Mm -hmm. we also have accumulated a lot of Taiwanese short films that actually came from open call submissions throughout the country over the past 20 years. So it's a huge like archive we have. So we each month now we uh, focus on a specific topic Uh that we curate the films around. So like, for example, in January, we had um, the... talk about the drag queen culture in Taiwan and Taiwan's TV representations for the LGBTQ community. Mm-hmm. And this month it is science fiction February. So we create Ooh. curated some supernatural and horror films based on local folklore and beliefs in Taiwan. My my yeah. favorite uh, my favorite books and TV shows actually sci fi fantasy that that those are my absolute favorites. All right, and uh, you should spe- check it out. <laughs> yes, definitely need to check that out. Um, because he, I've been in Taiwan for about twenty one, almost twenty two years now. Uh, so yes, I came here when I was four. <laughs> that's that. No, that's a, that's a running joke because I'm not old. I I'm, yeah, I'm I never to I never get it. older than twenty eight. Uh, so. <laughs> so, Me uh, neither. but uh, you don't look over twenty four anyway. <laughs> Thank you. So, uh, but so for to find uh, what was I trying to say? Ah, because uh, you know I I love sci fi and science fiction and things like that. Um, I I was also big into when I was little. Uh, like Shenhua Gushi mythology and yeah. and even though I've been here 22 years I haven't really gotten a lot into uh, like Taiwanese myths and mm. Taiwanese uh, like superstition or tradition or I there's stories that we've all heard uh, but I love it uh, I, I love to hear that uh, you guys are, are into doing sci-fi and doing horror and doing that from a from a local perspective yeah, it's very rarely heard of, right? Like you, you can't. It, it's you ha- hardly have any representations, like because normally you can find them in books, for example. Mm-hmm. But but it's like rarely also translated into English. So yeah, yeah. Okay, so that's cool. You've got. Uh, I also see you've got documentaries, uh, stuff for kids, nature, outdoor activities. Uh, history of Taiwanese traditional markets. I have watched some of those because oh, really? I I love um, I love stuff on culture. I'm a big foodie. I love to cook, mm-hmm. and so talking about Taiwanese traditional markets and things that you can get and trying out you know new things. I love shows like that. I absolutely love them. Uh, so I was very happy to see you had some <laughs> shows like that. Uh, you've also got uh, you've also got travel. Yeah, and. Uh, Mountain climbing as well, oh, like nature. Climbing. Yeah, so like yeah, it's a lot to take in. Um, also about the market, like it's very special because the host stays in each local traditional market for twenty four hours, so you can really see how the market runs oh, really? every single day. Yeah, it is. It is really interesting. Okay, now that that one I'm definitely going to have to check out then. Uh, so you can subscribe to the channel just. Uh, Search on YouTube. Uh, you can actually even Google it because I Googled it to, to get to the YouTube channel, PTS World Taiwan. And uh, now you guys are doing something interesting. Uh, you're having like a, kind of like a spring wine party that's coming up. Yes. And yes, super uh, you're doing something that I don't really hear of very often. Um, <laughs> uh, okay. They have a spring wine party. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just let you guys know. PTS World Taiwan is giving away an iPhone 13. 
and they're throwing a spring wine party. Now, what does this have to do with you, our listeners? Well, you may have the chance to go to the PTS Spring Wine Party. This is pretty cool. So tell us about this. Yeah, super excited. Uh, but first, let me ask you, do you know what is bando? That I do know. Like yeah. those roadside banquets. That Absolutely, yeah. Temp- yeah, you have been here. Well, like, temples, since are, temples are famous <laughs> for them, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. So so basically, we are throwing a spring party as a bando. Like, let me let me uh, elaborate a little so bit about it. So it's going to be it. a big outdoor party. Yes. Oh, okay. It will be outdoor. An, an outdoor feast, I should say. Yeah, and do you know what is electric flower car? Dian zi hua che. Of course, of you can't live in Taiwan for twenty years and not see those <laughs> everywhere. Uh, sometimes they have those with uh, people uh, dancing on them and singing. Sometimes they have them with. Uh, people playing instruments, or just you know, do or they after they stop, they throw it, they turn it into a stage and have a big show. They're pretty cool, exactly, and, and they're unique to Taiwan, I think. Yeah, yeah. So, so basically, what we're doing is combining these two. Uh huh. There's very Taiwanese stuff. Uh, so basically, like you said, bando is a roadside banquet, mm-hmm. and it, like it is a very Taiwanese tradition to hold some very important events. Uh, that. Up of um, like like company year and banquet, or sometimes the graduation banquet or weddings by the road under a tent. Yeah. And then the electric flower car. We have these truck turned into wheeled, uh, neon lit, flowery decorated moving stages. Right. So um, it will be a super local styled, and it will be a merge of like fashionable slash local and a very stylish. Roadside banquet that you've never seen before, uh, and we might it have. Sounds like, pretty cool. Yeah, we might have also like the Ding Tao drumming performances. We're Ooh. still we're still uh, checking it. Not not suddenly hundred percent, but something you can look forward okay. to. Okay. Well, and right now with COVID, things are changing all over, right? So, uh, you know, performances and that. Uh, yeah, I, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> 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 so, uh, working on having some performances. Cool. Now. Uh, for all of you listeners out there, why are we telling you about this spring, this you know, spring wine party that they're having? It sounds like a lot of fun. Well, it's because you might have a chance to go and even win an iPhone. Uh, tell them about that. Yeah, so it's very simple. You just have to like subscribe to our PTS World Taiwan YouTube channel. First things first. And then fill in an online questionnaire that you can also find on our channel. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and just by doing so, you'll also automatically enter an iPhone 13 giveaway. So subscribe to our YouTube channel and fill in the online questionnaire. And we really hope to see you at the spring party with the great food, drinks, dazzling performances, and also additional Ooh. iPhone 13 giveaway at uh, the party. Another. Yeah. Okay. So if you if you subscribe to the channel, fill in the online questionnaire, it, it, which by the way is completely free. You can you can join that for free. Uh, it only takes a few minutes to complete it, and to do that, if you do that, subscribe and fill out the questionnaire. You can you're automatically entered into an iPhone 13 giveaway, and if you are picked out to go to the Spring Wine, you actually have another chance for a lucky draw for another iPhone. Th- you could win yeah. two. Wouldn't that be weird? <laughs> Wouldn't that be funny if somebody won two? That would. You'd have to be really lucky. Yeah, I'd be that. really lucky. Yeah. <laughs> Might be even harder to win a lottery. I don't know. Maybe it's easier. <laughs> maybe, maybe. Uh, well, and and also, um, the w- what amazes me is when you go to those, uh, you know, the the roads, the roadside. Is it you, you said bando? That's like the Taiwanese. They, they call it also banzuo. Yeah, yeah, in Chinese, yeah. Um, but uh, what amazes me is you're at this big outdoor you know you're outdoor you're under a tent and of course uh these big round tables with the famous either pink or red uh either pink or red <laughs> everything tablecloths yeah. right uh but the food is so good yeah it is like coming one by one like yeah. we call it liu shui xi right yes oh, how's that in english <laughs> I, I, I love those banquets uh so again check out PTS World Taiwan brand new YouTube channel as of October uh, basically with a lot of high quality programming from uh, PTS here in Taiwan uh, that you can share with your friends and um, you know 
let them see Taiwan from uh, maybe possibly a perspective they've never seen it before, including uh, local TV programs, uh, specially produced programs, documentaries, kids, nature, outdoor stuff. Uh, it's basically, uh, it sounds like a, something I would binge watch. <laughs> would, definitely check it out yes and de- oh, but also like i just want to add like the date and location for that for that party is not specified so please follow like our instagram and youtube for latest updates for ah, that. okay yeah yeah definitely need to follow well of course if you if they want to be invited to the banquet they've got to follow all that information right <laughs> well, well we didn't make it like like this necessary oh, stuff. Oh, okay. We're nice. You're nice. You are. <laughs> so, I, I would be like, if you want to go, you've got to add my Instagram and like my Facebook. and <laughs> So basically, like and subscribe. And uh, w- what is it on Instagram? Do you know? It's also PTS World Taiwan. PTS Everywhere. World Taiwan on Instagram, uh, Facebook, and of course, the YouTube channel. So check it out. Well, thank you so much for joining us today, Whitney. Yeah, thank you so much, Stevie G. And uh, thank you, Young, for joining us. He's being very quiet in the background, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, but very happy to have you here. And uh, go check out PTS World Taiwan, the YouTube channel. That's all the time we've got for today. We will uh, talk to you guys again soon next time. Sure, thank you.